What the fuck is up, everyone? Hello. Welcome. It's Tuesday night, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you for tuning in, man. No, I appreciate that shit. Up on tonight's show, we have Alien Weaponry. With the track, Kai Tangata. Official video. Napalm Records. So, man, this, um... These boys have been getting some attention. Shit, man, I've had loads and loads of messages about Alien Weaponry. This one's been sitting in the playlist for a while, actually. It's been a good few weeks, man. I thought, you know what? Let's spice things up tonight, man, with a a three-piece thrash band from New Zealand, man. So, big up the New Zealand boys. I don't recall, if I'm wrong, apologies, but I don't recall featuring any bands from New Zealand, so this is pretty big. But, yeah, I've had... um, I've had loads of messages about this band. The the, the boys are um, teenagers, man. Fuck, teenagers started doing what they, they're doing now when they were 10. I did a little bit of reading and it says the tracks are typically highly political. And the vocals are in New Zealand's native language, Maori. Which is crazy interesting, man. Crazy interesting. I love the name as well, Alien Weaponry. One thing, it probably sounds a little bit weird, but one thing it made me think of, my favourite sci-fi film, District 9. Not too sure why, man, but that's some pretty badass alien weaponry, right? But big up those New Zealand boys, man. Holy fuck. I'm super excited for this. It sounds like something a little bit different. But let me know below what you're thinking. Um, Like I said, can't say I've heard any Maori metal before, but I'm game as a little motherfucker, man. You know me. Hope you're all well, though. It's Tuesday. Hope you're having a sweet week so far. Yeah, man, I'm interested to hear what you fuckers think of this. Who knows, eh? As always, man, Posy Vibes only. This is Alien Weaponry, Kai Tangata, official video, Napalm Records. Pick up the Tuesday night crew. Pick up the fucking New Zealand crew, man. Oh, fuck. Oh, that's fucking tribal shit, boy. It's like that apocalypto fucking film, man. Wow. This is gonna be serious, you know. You fuck is ready, man. Oh, oh, oh yeah! Hype man, hype! Oh, oh. Oh, oh, oh. Ah, ah, this is this is just so fucking metal, man. Yeah. Ah, them, them fucking boys, man. Wow. Well, this is one case to show one way to showcase your fucking culture, man. Yeah. <laughs> this video is so badass, though. Uh, it's <laughs> just so fucking manly. Oh wow. Yeah. 
Yeah. This is super interesting, man. Oh, I just wish I could sing along. This shit's fucking crazy, boy. Oh, fuck. Oh, <laughs> fucking hack and break, though, man. Yeah. <laughs> wow! <laughs> Holy fuck! Oh, this is just all kinds of badass, man. Wow! Give me more fucking hacker breakdowns in my life, boy. Yeah. Dude, these these boys sure do love to move their fucking heads, man. Yeah. Give me your fucking heads. Wow. That's my kind of fucking hardcore dancing boy. Yeah, man. Holy fuck. Well, man. Sometimes you just don't know what to expect. That's Alien Weaponry with Kai Tangata. Official video. Napalm records. Oh man, that that was just that was just metal on so many levels, man. Holy, <laughs> holy fuck, man. Big up those fucking those New Zealand Maori boys, though. Wow, man. So, I said I'm I'm um, I'm able to say I've I've never heard Maori metal before. It's not something I expected to be hearing on the channel or otherwise. But man, that shit was just all kinds of badass, man. What was the track about? Seven minutes long. Shit, that just flew by. I didn't feel like seven minutes whatsoever. I thought just the whole package, man, the, the cinematography with just with the just the badass fucking track. 
it, it just flew by, man. It completely fucking flew by. Now, the first thing, um, and, and it kind of, you know, I did mention it earlier on about the, a lot of the vocals are in the native, you know, Maori language, but it still hit me, man. You know, it, it really did. And obviously, I you know, couldn't pick up what the, what the dude was saying there, what the dude was saying there, but that shit was fitting, man. Just so powerful and, and fucking passionate, man. I mean, I think... You know, when I've heard it, I've seen, I've seen um, them doing the hacker. You know, when New Zealand play rugby, and I'm not a big, big rugby fan by any means. But I know going back, man, just hearing that that really powerful, like manly, like chant. That shit's crazy, man. Absolutely fucking crazy. Really riveting, and to hear it alongside those fucking crunching riffs. Really interesting, man. Really fucking interesting and really captivating. Um. But yeah, it's you know moving moving back over to the hacker though, man. One thing that really does need a special fucking mention. He said that's really my only knowledge of of Maori culture is from what I've seen in the rugby and I've seen it I've seen it on TV and that that hacker my it gives me goosebumps every time. It's just so fucking impressive, so manly, so powerful, so passionate. And um, can we just take a minute? Just take a little minute to reflect on the Maori. Hacker breakdown, though. <laughs> Holy fucking shit, man. Oh my god, they had a fucking hacker for the breakdown. Boy, that shit was so fucking cool, man. That shit was so fucking cool. That's one way to showcase your heritage and your culture, man. Holy fuck. I mean, I've said it quite a few times on here. We get a lot of people saying about my accent and, and things like that. And I think you should never lose who you are, man. You should always be fucking proud of where you're from, from your history. That's one way to put it across. Wow. I thought that as a whole package, it was extremely cool, man. Like I said, taking into account these are really young lads as well. Putting themselves out there like this. The cinematography was fantastic. It was really interesting. Like I said, it, it had that apocalypto vibe for me. It was just really badass and really fucking manly. It was awesome, man. It was really awesome. I've learned a little bit about Maori culture today as well. Very interesting to see like, what I got from that was when they, they took guns from England over to New Zealand, man. And, well, it doesn't look like the results were great, but overall, man, that was just so impressive, so powerful, so much energy. Um, slight Sepultura vibe there as well, man. Slight Sepultura vibe for um, big up the fucking New Zealand boys, the Maori boys. If you fuckers ever see this, man. You fuckers are the coolest, I'll tell you that right now. Wow, didn't expect that on a Tuesday evening, but let me know below what you're thinking of a little bit of Maori metal. Holy shit. As always, man. Thank you fuckers for all tuning in. <laughs> you know how much I appreciate that shit. See you all soon. <laughs>